Does the hole in the ozone layer actually cause global warming? The ozone layer is a layer of gas called ozone in the Earth's stratosphere. Ozone is composed of three oxygen atoms and does a splendid job at absorbing harmful UV radiation from the sun. Since the 1980s, we have discovered a hole opening up in the layer of ozone above the continent of Antarctica. I say hole, but it's just a bad name for what is otherwise a depletion in the ozone in that certain area. And it has declined due to the high amounts of chlorofluorocarbons or CFCs pumped into the atmosphere from the 1950s onwards, which were used in aerosols and refrigeration. Of course, we have now realized this and stopped the production of these CFCs and the hole is actually starting to repair itself. But does that hole in the ozone layer actually contribute to global warming? Well, no, it doesn't. For starters, the average temperature of Earth is continuing to rise despite the improvement in the ozone levels at the hole. And secondly, the ozone blocks the UV. That's its main job. It's a greenhouse gas, yes, but there's actually a cooling effect in the immediate area of the hole. This is because there is less ozone to keep the heat in, which is radiating back off the Earth's surface. Besides, the protective benefit of ozone far outweighs any greenhouse effect it may cause. So there we go. Yes, there is a hole in the ozone there, and no, it does not contribute anywhere near as much to global warming as you may think. I've been Simon Dan, this has been another Misconception Mini, and I'll see you next time. Yeah, I'm in the garden. Subscribe here. That's the subscribe button. More videos, more videos. Enjoy.